Hi guys, welcome to the questions from the Board of Studies portal of ICAI. We are doing chapter number one. Already all the MCQs from the module of ICAI are already there on our YouTube channel, arranged in a playlist form. There we have tried to give the concepts, we have tried to do a revision and then we all solve the questions. So therefore everything is perfectly clear to you. Same thing we are attempting for Board of Studies questions also. So the question for today is strategic cost management is implementation of cost and management techniques to improve and sustain the company's strategic position as well as reduce the cost. The three important pillars of SCM are so therefore the four options are strategic positioning, value chain analysis and business environmental analysis, cost driver analysis, strategic positioning and value chain. Then value chain, strategic positioning and performance analysis and strategic positioning, value chain and business environment analysis. Now, first of all, what is strategic cost management? See, it's basically cost management techniques which are aligned to the strategies of the company. When it gets combined, we try to be saying that it is nothing but strategic cost management. See, ultimately aim of doing every business should be like, you know, that whatever are the visions that we all have in mind, we should be able to achieve them. And to achieve them, we require a lot of techniques. One of them is cost management. Cost management often confused with cost reduction. It is not that. Sometimes you need to increase the cost, okay, to get more amount of profit and try to achieve the strategies that you all have made for your business. Many companies, in fact, try to increase their cost because they think increasing the cost will increase the value of the product and customers will eventually buy. SCM has three pillars and those are value chain analysis, value chain analysis. Every company, if you all try to be thinking in a broad terms, basically is nothing but group of activities. All these group of activities are divided into uh, primary activities, support activities. In primary activities, we all have five inbound logistics, operations, outbound logistics. You have marketing and sales and after sales service and secondary activities consist of activities like your procurement, your human resource technology and firm infrastructure. Now we should always be thinking which activities are adding value, which activities are not adding value and company should only try to do those activities which add value. That is value chain. That's the first pillar to identify which activity should be done, which should not be done. Strategic positioning analysis. This means what? See, every company is operating under a business environment which is influenced not only by whatever we all do but external factors also how much is the competition what kind of products are available in the market what are the expectation of the stakeholders that are there all these things will determine where the company will be in the market and lastly cost driver analysis every cost is incurred because of some underlying factor example ordering cost in ca inter was incurred why because you try to place an order then setup cost is incurred because you set up the machines. Okay, these are the three pillars of your SEM. And therefore, in this particular case, your answer should be, I guess, wherever these three words are there. And that is nothing but second, cost driver analysis, strategic positioning and value chain analysis. Okay, that should be the correct answer. I say is given the description, but I hope that I have covered it up. Now, just one thing before I'll be ending, aim of all these questions is basically whenever I'm trying to read the question, whenever I try to give those four options, you all should pause the video at that time and you all should try to say whatever is the correct answer as per you. Now, whether that is right or wrong, that is a different thing. But if it is right, you will develop the confidence. Yes, that I answer this question right. So in future, in exam, if this question comes, you will always be spot on. And if it is wrong, it will remain on back of your mind that this was the correct answer. So please make use of these videos. Okay, tell to all your friends who still have to appear for this paper that what kind of questions we are trying to be posting. That's it for today. I'll see you all next time with another question from the BOS portal. Thank you guys. Bye.